Hey everybody, it's Mike from Real Black, and today I want to talk about Hong Kong cinema and do an unboxing of the latest Shaw Scope Volume 2. But before I get to that, I just want to let you know about two other recent releases that have made it to home video in the last month. Uh, first, from Criterion, the Infernal Affairs Trilogy, which um, a lot of people may or may not have seen the original Infernal Affairs, but a lot of people have seen Martin Scorsese's The Departed, which is what this is based on. And then our friends at 88 Films have come out with The Dragons Forever. Whoops, can you see that? Dragons Forever with the Jackie Chan and Sammo Hung. I can't wait to dig into this. But um, today, my special Christmas present arrived from Amazon just in time for the holidays. If you're watching this after the holidays, today's December 22nd. And I'm gonna crack open this box. Oh, there's another box inside of it. I don't have my thing. I like this because um, you can make sure that it maintains its collector's value. It's not getting dinged and beat around in the mail. But uh, if you saw the previous Shaw Scope unboxing, you know that I'm a big Hong Kong Shaw Brothers fan. Whoa! This is beautiful. Shaw Scope Volume 2. Alright, let's get into it. My eyesight's getting a little bad, but this is the limited edition Blu-ray edition of the Shaw Scope Volume 2. The reason I wanted it so badly is because it's got 36 Chamber of Shaolin, which is master killer for for most of the people that know, and then Return of the 36th Chamber with Gordon Liu and uh, Disciples of the 36th Chamber. It also has Mad Monkey Kung Fu, Five Super Fighters, Invincible Shaolin, The Kid with the Golden Arm, Magnificent Ruffians, Ten Tigers of Kwa Tung, My Young Auntie, Mercenaries from Hong Kong, The Boxer's Omen, Martial Arts of Shaolin, and Barefooted Kid. Plus, um, on disc nine, the music from the 36 Chambers, Five Super Fighters, Invincible Shaolin, Kid with the Golden Arm, and then a, a tenth disc, which is a CD with music from Return to the 36 Chamber, Magnificence, Ruffians, Ten Tigers of Kwa Tung, My Young Auntie, Mercenaries from Kung Fu, uh, Mercenaries from Hong Kong, and Disciples of the 36 Chamber. So you have basically eight Blu-ray discs of movies and two discs that have the music from the movies in it. Let's crack it open because what's always cool about these Arrow limited edition box sets, Shaw Scopes, is the artwork at what is inside. Wow, right away you can see on the artwork there's a picture of Master Killer on the cover and some of the other folks. I think that's a young Jackie Chan and doing the different poses. Ah, uh, okay. Let me slide this open. And we see that the discs themselves, like the previous edition, are packaged in a book wallet style with uh, a card holding up each one of the movies. What's interesting to me right off the bat, a little residue here, um, 36 Chamber, which we, we know is, is Master Killer, has so many extras, it's not even funny. So um, a lot of times these Arrow movies, they're, they're brand new transfers of the movies and then they do a, a great job on the bonus features. So this has a brand new 4K restoration by Celestial Pictures. Uh, this is the 1080p Blu-ray presentation of the film. Uh, new trans newly translated subtitles, brand new commentary by 
critic Travis Crawford, scene select commentary by Tony Rains, interview from 2003 with Gordon Liu, interview with cinematographer Arthur Wong from 2006, uh, Shaolin, Birthplace of a Hero and Elegant Trails, two archive featurettes with Gordon Liu from 2003. Tiger Style, Musical Impact of Martial Arts Cinema, a newly filmed overview of the Shaw Brothers' influence on hip hop and other musical genres. Cinema Hong Kong, Sword Fighting, second installment of a three-part documentary produced by Celestial Pictures in 2003. Alternate opening credits from the American version called Master Killer, which is what we know, and the Hong Kong and German theatrical trailers plus U.S. trailer spot. So um, I know it's a little late uh, to get this in for Christmas. You might be able to, or if you ordered it today, you might be able to get it in by Christmas. But right, I, right now it's at the right price on Amazon, which I, I paid about one hundred and seven dollars for this. Retails for one hundred and eighty nine. Um, and uh, as you see, there's Master Killer right there. Uh, they typically have posters. Let's see. There's still frames, stills from the movies included here. Let's see if they have the poster artwork, which is always fun. Um, lots of great photos here uh, from all the films. I'm trying not to get this too messed up. There's Samo. There's the poster for 36 Chamber. If you're a Hong Kong Kung Fu classic cinema fan like I am, you don't want to miss this out on this while you can get it at the right price. Um, to Master Killer and Return of the 36 Chambers were out on Blu-ray a few years back through Weinstein Company and Celestial Pictures, and they typically were retailing for $36. Um, maybe you could find it for $20. So to get 14 movies in one box set, for roughly a hundred, ten, hundred and twenty dollars, I think is a great bargain. And I urge anybody, any fan or somebody who's a friend of a fan to go out and grab this one. Um, once again, to recap, we talked about Shaw Scope, Volume Two, from 88 Films, Dragons Forever with Samo and, and Jackie, and the Infernal Affairs trilogy from Criterion. So that's that's our wrap up uh, for our Hong Kong cinema fans. And um, you know, feel free to leave your comments below. I'd love to hear what you think about uh, these releases. Thank you.